This week on Woodwork Solutions Presents. We're going to show you how to install wrought iron balusters. A staircase is the focal point of many homes. It is often the first thing guests see as they enter your front door. Reinventing your staircase will give your home the elegance and sophistication it deserves. Let's get started. Once you have removed the previous post, start by pre-drilling holes for your new spindles. In this case, Kevin is using a 5 8 paddle drill bit. Next, gather all your materials so you're ready to work. Make sure you remove all plastics and packaging. This might be a good time to make sure you have the correct amount of each piece. Now it's time to measure. Remember, they all won't be the same size, so double check your work before you make any cuts. Once you have your correct measurement, start to cut your spindles. Make sure you use a metal cutting blade to ensure a proper and precise cut. Once you have your spindles cut and ready to go, start by applying epoxy to the top handrail hole. Next, to install, insert spindle into lower hole, followed by sliding it up into the top handrail hole. Once that's complete, apply epoxy to the bottom hole. Finally, tighten the set screw found on the shoe. The shoes are for cosmetic purposes and cover up the gap between the square baluster and the round holes. Now that you've completed one, keep going. You've got a ways to go. Or you can call the professionals. Here at Woodwork Solutions, we will enhance your home with a custom banister in less than one day. Give us a call today or visit us on the web, www dot woodworksolutions dot net no,